Well, a piece of history in one community is now gone. The country store just outside of Bethel was destroyed in Monday night's severe weather. WNCT's Connor Kick talks to the owner as he reflects on what the store means as he prepares to tear it down. This was a, the country store for many years. It was built in uh, 1916. This 100-year-old building was something more than a vacant structure to those in the community. It served as a place to grab a snack, buy groceries, or just hang out. Been very family-oriented, very community-oriented, where the community gathered for a number of years. Built by Everett's wife's father, this building was not only a memory of good times, but a reminder of his wife. It was, of course, part of my wife's family, and uh, she was a big part of my life. And um, <coughs> it meant a lot to her. One member in the community I spoke to says she treated this place like a member of the family because she grew up in it. It's a part of our memories that will be gone forever. It was the kindness of those who ran the store that kept the community strong. So if you came up here and didn't have money, you left with a bag of groceries regardless. That's the kind of character these people had. For the family that ran the store, it was the backbone of what family means to them. It was our roots. It was for us in my family, my siblings, it was, it was just family. It's what family is all about. And for the future of the store? I, I, I see no other choice but to demolish it and take it down uh, because it, it's just not practical to repair it back, in my opinion. The building may be gone, but Clayton Everett says that the memories will last forever. Reporting just outside of Bethel, Connor Cake, not on your side.